Hello everyone, Xenazim here, and welcome back to Blastmaster Zero. Last time, we one shot at a boss. This time, we're inside a mutant. I don't know how smart that is to be, but hey, we'll make it through. These cubes are actually part mutant, so they can turn into mutants. However, rooms like these are perfect for acceleration blasts. This room's got spikes all over, and it just does not care. Yeah, you still have to deal with enemies, but I'll be real. I'd rather deal with the enemies than platforming. Oh my god. Now let's roll through. Oh, is this the right way? I want to say it's not, but Not all of those contain mutants, so there's some positivity. Okay, now I'm just gonna wait. You know what? <sighs> nope, that's the right way. That's not good. The good news is, uh, these stay destroyed. Annoying way the enemies respawn, but does make things a tiny bit easier. Now we get big health. Now let's go in. Oh, this is the restock run. I'm quite sure. Just in case it isn't, we'll go through. And even if it is, it might be best that you guys know about it. Just in case. Because I don't know what you're on. Is like.
Maybe you play it recklessly. I believe it's just down here. So let's check the other end. I believe there's a slight change in coloring for those blocks, if you can, so you can tell if there is a mutant or not. And yep, yeah, you can probably tell oh, we did a lot of damage. I mean, we could do it again. But I'd rather just be quick about it. Plus, not have to deal with recharge timings. Going back to cell. This bit is infamous in Blaster Master 1. Oh boy. I'm not even going to be giving it this time of day. I'm not even going to deal with this. There's quite a lot. I believe the lower path is the path of one. But we don't want that path. We're going to go to this path. And, oh, I believe this is the map. Good. doing? I believe this is the one area where you can just... No it's not. I don't think it is. Oh. I believe it's upwards. If I am right. Give us some time. Oh. 
da, 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 da. And we've got the map. So I was right. No, it's we're here. It's all right. Not completely. Bow, bow. Now with that, we can see we've got three bosses. Interesting, isn't it? Cannot survive. I got Proton John without being Proton John. That is impressive. Not allowing that to happen again. And drop. And we're fully charged. <sighs> so nice. A nice sacrifice. Okay. Oh. Switching to striker, switching to flash. Thankfully, it isn't too complicated. Complicated. I believe. Right, there's also these. There we go. Now, last checkpoint. Uh, uh. 
warning. Cell rejection. These guys. We want striker. It just makes this a, a joke. The problem comes in in their speed. You know what? I'm gonna break a turret. And we'll get our final life up. With this, we have 100% of items. I will say, if you don't get it at 100%, Well, you get a different ending. So, I will talk about it. when we get the ending. Oh my god. Uh, left or right? Right. Thunder! Oh my god. Oh, that's nice. In the original, this wasn't a water area. Honestly, while I'm not too big a fan, honestly, it's, at least it has, at least the dive has some utility in this game, compared to the literal none it had. left because yeah no we're not we're not risking that jump what do you think I am crazy more cell projections okay we do a turret Right. But now, let's just move on to the boss. The penultimate boss. Antibody cell. I believe this guy is actually weak to wave, which is hilarious. But we want striker because it makes 
everything else about it a joke. So, we've got everything. What can we get from it? A key. Key 2. I don't know why. The mutant body needs a key. But it has one. So, let's jump across. We'll let these guys try. Be nice to the mutants before their mutant overlord gets utterly decimated. And you know what? Last one for the road. Sophia, it's been fun. But sadly, this is Jason's turn. I just confirmed that the mutant lord is free here. J Jason, this... Yeah, this is the moment of truth. Come on, Eve. Come on, no doom and gloom faces now. I'm glad I take this thing down. You should be on guard too. Never know what might show up here. Yeah, I'll do that. Promise me you'll come back, okay? You got it. I promise. Well... Here I go. In the original, this was just a restock room. We didn't have these choices. Now, we do. I believe it's slightly... I, I don't know. Like, what the map is. I know it ends, they all end in the same place, so... What I like to do is, the same as a lot of other people, keep going right. <laughs> it's by far one of the easier options, plus you don't fight that much. There's no need to try. In essence, because I believe this is the second actual one we actually have to try for. Oh my god! move. And I believe this is the last restock room. room. We want these two weapons. I found the mutant lord. This feels completely different from the other mutants. My sense of danger. My sense of danger is complete off the charge right now. Be careful. Jay. Son. Hey, Jay! What? Eve? Eve? Crap! Trap mission is dead! Ah. This is the mutant lord's causing this? I'm so worried about Eve and Fred. But there's only one thing to do now. It's you and me now. Now, mutant lord. I'm gonna put an end to this. Warning! The galaxy master. Underworld lord. And we want to just put a turret out. And just do this. He can't do anything because he's got a whip. But that's just phase one. If you've got all. everything before coming here, this happens. It's no use. I can't get the transmission working. Please be safe, Jason. What's this? Some kind of mutant? It's the same as the mutant lord. No. 
Is he even stronger? No way. This can't be happening. The true power of this thing is so overwhelming. Not to mention, it's new form. Is this the mutant lord's true form? The one that possesses intelligence? Even if it is, I can't lose now. I gotta protect the earth. And Eve. Warning! The ultimate meta fight. Multi-dimensional overlord. The overlord. As many people have already joked, so I've just... I can say, yeah, I've stolen that joke. So, uh, so, just to keep it quickly shortened, I'm going to call it the Overlord. The Overlord has four forms. In the switch between them, random. Uh, none of them can be hurt by wave. Red is weak to diffusion. Blue, weak to reflect. Orange, weak to all. No, actually, not on. Orange is weak to striker. Green is weak to auto, uh -oh, and yeah, <laughs> part of me hopes he goes to green so I can just kill him with level one blaster. <laughs> Proton John did it. I I want to too. Oh, did he just he switch? Level 1 Blaster! I did not mean to take a picture. <laughs> that was just so great! <laughs> Eve! Eve, can you hear me? Jason? Yes, I can hear you! Thank god, for goodness you say. So, yeah. <laughs> Ripped her. From Blaster. <laughs> I got so worried when the cons went down. But it looks like you're alright too. What a relief. Yeah, Sophia was a huge help. So is the mutant lord? Yeah, so I was able to defeat it. I think I saw it destroyed, right before my eyes. I used to have one blaster, so I hope I wasn't seeing things. <laughs> so I certainly hope that's the end of it. Just in case, can you just get and make sure you don't pick anything that resembles it? Just as I thought. Well then, Eve, is something wrong? No, it's nothing. There's no trace of the mutant lord here anymore. I see. That means our battle for the mutants is over. Yeah, sure is. You saved this planet, Jason. Not quite. We saved it. You, me, Fred, and Sophia too. I never could have done it by myself. <laughs> I'm happy to hear you say that, but that was our mission. So that means Eve. Let's say Sophia's found a route back to the surface, Jason. You can leave when you get back. I'll be waiting for you. Got it. I'm on my way now. It's, been, it's beautiful. Yeah, it sure is. We're welcome back to the surface by a nice guy full of countless glistening stars. Thank you for everything, Jason. I'm here now because you saved me and you were there for me. I just did what I thought was right. But I'm happy. That meant I was able to help you out. Yeah. You've done more for me than I could ever ask for, which is why I can't ask you to do more anymore than I already have. Eve? Suddenly I felt a very warm, tender feeling. <laughs> that was Eve, hugging me tightly. Uh, I don't think it was Eve. I think he was hugging you, but I think that tender feeling, I think it's called a, a little thing. A crazy little feeling. Thing. Oh, love. Although it took me quite a while to fully understand why. Jason, I have to go so that I can protect you and this planet. Eve, what are you? Oh, what? I felt like the energy was being sapped from my body. My vision got all hazy. I could barely stand up. What's going on? I don't understand. Don't worry. You'll only be unconscious for a little while. What are you talking about? Everything quickly grew dim. My body was so warm. And before I knew it, I completely lost consciousness. The last thing I saw was that for the first time, Eve looked like she was about to cry. 
I'm so sorry. I knew you would have helped me if I asked. I'm sure of it. But this mutant core, we know nothing about it and we have never even come face to face with it. Based on the readings I have, I can't guarantee that even Sophia being fully powered up like this stands a chance against it. I couldn't bear the thought of you, of dragging you into a battle against something that dangerous. I know I'm being completely selfish, but there's something I must do. I'm hanging out, Jace. Where? What happened? Oh no, Eve! I remember her words. In fact, she was going to save the plant and me. Not to mention, she looks so sad. Even just remembering it makes my heart ache. I looked around and saw Sophia was gone too. I tried to contact them, but it was no use. The connection was totally shot. That's when I remember something she told me. She said there was still a certain thing here on Earth that had to be destroyed. Fred? <laughs> Looks like Eve left you here too. What should I do, Barney? Is there really nothing I can do? As if he was telling me to fall in. Fred looked over at me and began to hop off somewhere. Where are you going? I followed after him and noticed he went to the same place where he fell down that wormhole hole when I was chasing him a while back. Fred, what are you? Fred opened his mouth and suddenly the area around us began to tremble. What? Hey, what's going on? The area began to tremble even more. Then a strange hole appeared out of nowhere, right in front of me. No way. Is this is this a wormhole? Indeed, one of Fred's abilities is to create these so he has this direct path to be able to return to Sophia. That portal at the beginning again? Yeah, that was Fred. The wormhole kept on expanding. The moment when the wormhole expanded to its maximum size, it began to come into view. I wonder what it could be. This is a brand new tank. It looks like Sophia, but something is different. I got closer to it with the cockpit opened up. Friend I hopped in again, like the beginning. This one's called Sophia Zero. Nice one, developers. Is it some kind of upgraded version? His abilities and weaponry seem even more powerful than Sophia Freers, the Thirds. At its core, though, it seems to be the same as Sophia the Third. So in that case, if I can just take my blast rifle, blast rifle authentication complete, switching from autopilot to manual operation. All right, here we go. What's this? Message? Huh. I see. So that's how it is. Alright, I know what I have to do. Fred, can you open another warmer hole and get me to where Sophia and Eve are located? We have no time to waste. I'm counting on you, buddy. Eve, please be safe. And Area 9. What is this place? I emerged from the wormhole and into a strange place that was an amalgamation of a bunch of different things. Am I still on Earth? Or somewhere completely different? Regardless of where I end up, I need to look for Eve. And Sophia. Sophia Zero. Before we end off, we have two things. First, the ending. We don't get every upgrade. Shows Eve failed to defeat the mutant core. And then tries to blow up Sophia, herself, and the mutant core. Sophia Zero is indeed more powerful. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this! No damage! Missiles? Five! Thunder? Multi directional. Home missiles? Small and fast. Spark tackle? 
long, last longer. Shield mine? Actually useful. But the best comes from our one and only overpowered thing. Well, let's look at our new acceleration blast. Oh wait. Oh yeah. Not only change the sprite, faster charging. Honestly, Sophia Zero, an upgrade in every way. Next time on Blaster Master Zero, it's time to save Eve. Truly. Next episode is the end of the beginning. The beginning of the end. This is Zeno Zima.